and gentlemen, now is the time for everybody's favorite portion of a Toastmasters evening, table topics. This is when I will ask one of you Toastmasters or Toast Mistresses to answer a question in an impromptu manner. I will ask a question and then I will call one of you guys or dolls to come up and answer the question immediately. You will not have time to prepare, but don't worry, these questions don't require too much background knowledge and it is feasible that you will be able to answer them in one minute to qualify, one and a half for yellow light, and two minutes for a red light. As for our honored guests and guestettes, Beverly, <laughs> would you honor us with your presence up here after I ask one of these toast dudes or toast dudettes a question or three first so you know the flow? Sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And would the lovely couple who arrived recently like to participate? It's okay to say no. <laughs> Take it under advisement. Okay. Let's see what the question is. Every good Toastmasters meeting needs a theme. The theme to tonight's meeting will be the battle of the sexes. As a good Toastmaster or Toast woman, you will have to answer a question that you might not be comfortable with, and you might have to take an argument that you might not fully agree with. So, would you mind giving us an argument as to why women are physically and mentally superior to men. Renata. <laughs> <laughs> why are women physically and mentally superior to men? Wow, why are women physically and mentally superior to men? I don't know if I agree with that. <laughs> uh, some of you may know I work out regularly. I go to the gym, and honestly, I, I'm awed by some of the women that I see at the gym. I saw a girl just last week, I'm not kidding, doing dumbbell presses with 40-pound dumbbells. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't even do that myself. <laughs> 40 pounds is a lot of weight. 40 pounds, 80 pounds. I think it's a case by case. I think. Some people are just naturally strong and very athletic, and some aren't. So I, I don't think, I don't buy the fact that men or a woman is stronger than the other sex. It depends, I think, on the person. And some of it, I think, is genetics. So I don't know what else to say, except I think it's a case-by-case -case basis. I've seen some women that are really, really strong. In fact, I've gone up to a couple women at the gym, and I'm like, Wow, I couldn't help but notice you're working out with all this heavy weight. And they're just naturally strong. And then I've seen some guys that are, you know, they're doing curls with 20 pound dumbbells. And I'm like, really? 20 pounds is like nothing. And I see some guys doing 80 pounds. So I think it really is a case by case basis. I don't really buy into the, into the logic of, you know, the men are always strong. Mm -hmm. 